Hi, my name is Dylan Jones, and I'd like to welcome you to another Tech Talk by Frontier Precision. In today's session, we are going to cover a useful Trimble Access service called Access Sync. Access Sync is a cloud based file sharing service that links up a Trimble survey controller to the Trimble Connected Community, or as I will call it, TCC. There are many benefits to using Access Sync and TCC for both the Office user and the field user. The main benefit of using Trimble Access Sync and TCC is that data gets sent to a logged in user instead of a specific serialized controller. This allows for flexibility for the field user to access data from any data collector as long as the Trimble Access software warranty is up to date. It also allows the office person to manage multiple data collectors at a time and remotely. This is also beneficial as it will keep field software up to date giving you the latest and greatest features and benefits of Trimble Access. Each TCC organization is allowed 100 login usernames and 10 gigs of data storage. Therefore you should be able to access numerous files at any point as long as there is an internet connection. Lastly, the file upload and download process is simple and will save time both in the office and in the field. The requirements for the Office user include an internet browser and internet connection in order to sync files to your TCC file storage space. You will also need a download Trimble Installation Manager in order to install Trimble Connected Community Explorer application. Optionally, you can manage all your data files through Trimble Business Center instead of the TCC Explorer. Both will be covered later in this video. The requirements for the field user include an internet connection, to sync files to and from your data collector and the office. This is not a requirement while conducting your survey, but solely for syncing your data files. You must be using a TSC2, TSC3, or a Trimble tablet with current Trimble Access software maintenance agreement. You can check if your Trimble Access software is under warranty by tapping the Trimble icon in the top left corner of your Trimble Access screen, then selecting About. Lastly, you must create a Trimble Connected Community account for your organization. You can register for a TCC account at my.trimbleaccess.com. I will now demonstrate how to utilize TCC and Access Sync, starting with how to create a TCC account. I will then roll into managing users and sites, installing TCC Explorer through Trimble Installation Manager, transferring data from the office to the field controller, Downloading and opening a job file in Trimble Access using Access Sync functionality. How to sync a newly created job file to the TCC Cloud Storage. And lastly, how you can optionally manage your data using Trimble Business Center. Alright, we will begin by opening up our web browser and going to my.trimbleaccess.com. This will open us up to the Trimble Access Services login page where we can enter in our username organization and password, or register for a new organization. You will see that in order to use Trimble Access Services, you must have a TCC organization for your company. With the TCC organization, you will get one site administrator account, 100 logins, and 10 gigabytes of storage. On the next page, you will need to enter in a serial number of one of your controllers and your Trimble dealer. Click the next button and then enter in your full company name and then type in a short name for your company. This will be the organization ID when signing into Trimble Access Services. Click the next button and then you'll type in your site administrator information and then click submit. That should be all you need to do to register. Now click Return to Login. Within a few seconds you should receive a confirmation email from Trimble.com. This is how you activate your TCC account. Click the link in the email and then it should open you back up to the Trimble Access Services page. Now your TCC organization is being activated. You will want to save your site manager username and organization information to go back in and edit your account later on. Now click return to login.
Sign in to your Trimble Access Services account using your site manager username, organization, and password. Accept the Terms of Use and End User License Agreement page. And then now we're at the administration page for your TCC organization. Click Manage Users. This is where you will add a user to your organization. Enter in the field user's information and then click Next. If you have an existing site, you can give this user permission by clicking the box under Allow Access. You can now see that the user has been added to the list. Next, click on the Administration tab on the top and then click Manage Sites. This is where we will add a site or modify or delete an existing site. You can see here that I've created a site titled Maple Grove. I can modify or delete this site or I can add a new site. Creating sites is a way to better organize your users. This way you can give users permission to access data for certain projects. To create a new site, you'll just need to enter in a site title, site short name or ID, and a description of that site. Associate specific users to that site by clicking the Allow Access box, and then click Finish. The newly created site will appear in your list of sites, and you can also modify or delete that site just as you would with a user. Alright, now I'll show you how to install Trimble Connected Community Explorer on your PC using Trimble Installation Manager. So to download Trimble Installation Manager, you'll want to go to trimble.com slash installation manager. On the right side of the screen, click Download Trimble Installation Manager Online Version. It will begin downloading. Once you have installed Trimble Installation Manager, open the program to see what is installed on your computer. Make sure to check the box for Trimble Connected Community File Explorer and then click Install. You will know that the installation was successful when you see the green circle next to the item. You can exit Trimble Installation Manager and open up Windows Explorer on your PC. Under Computer, double click on TCC Explorer, then enter in your Trimble Connected Community account information. Once you log in, you will see your organization and a public file spaces folder. Double click on your organization folder, and then you will see a list of sites. Choose the site that you would like to upload data to, and then likewise with the user that you would like to send data to. Choose the folder to the field if you are sending data out to the field user, and then you will see a system files folder. From here, you can drag and drop or copy and paste the files that you want to send out to the user. Make sure that you drop them into the folder called To The Field, not the System Files folder. The files should now be accessible to the field user as long as there is an internet connection on the data collector. The next thing we need to do is log into the TCC account in Trimble Access to sync files to the controller. To do this, open up Trimble Access on the data collector and tap on the user on the gray bar. Log in using online mode 
Type in your organization short name, your username, and your password. Click the next button to begin logging in. Remember that you need an internet connection at this time. Choose the site that contains the projects to be synchronized from and then click the next button. When login has completed, pick finish. Now you should see your username up top followed by your organization short name. Next, pick access sync. This window shows the list of folders in which you can download data files from. Pick your user folder, in my case that is Jake W, and then you'll see the status one of two files received. At the bottom you can see which files are being received and once it is all synced up you'll see a check mark next to the status. You can also check the history of data files synchronization when they were received and at what time. And then now your data file should be synced to your controller. From here we can ensure that our files were properly downloaded by selecting files. This will open up your file explorer and navigate you to the Trimble data folder. Select your username and then you should see your files that had been transferred. Now you can navigate back to the Trimble Access screen and open up General Survey. From here you can open up your existing job that we just transferred over and complete any survey work that you need to be performed in that job. It is also possible to create a new job in the field and sync that back up to the Trimble Connected Community Cloud. I will demonstrate how to do that here. With a new job created, exit General Survey and open Access Sync. With an internet connection established, newly created or modified jobs will be automatically synced up to the Trimble Connected Community Cloud. That is literally all you need to do to sync your data files back to the Office user. Back in the office, open up Windows Explorer and double click on TCC Explorer. Open up your organization and the site which your data files exist. You'll now see a from folder. This folder contains data that has been synced from the controller to the cloud. Simply copy and paste any data file from the from folder to the local PC folder. The same office file management techniques can also be done using Trimble Business Center. To start, open Trimble Business Center and select Trimble Access Services from the start page. Sign in to your Trimble Connected Community account. It will automatically open you up to your default site. If you would like to switch to an alternate site, click on the drop down arrow in the top right hand side of the screen and select the appropriate site. Now within the appropriate site, you can choose to upload a file or manage an existing file. I will demonstrate how you can download an existing file. Select Manage Files. And then navigate to the appropriate folder. Right click on the file you wish to download. And then at the bottom you will see Download File. Choose the Save option in the File Download window, and then select where you would like to save the file to.
In summary, we reviewed how to create a TCC account for your organization. We created a new user and new site within our organization, which will assist in organizing the data. We demonstrated where to download Trimble Installation Manager and install TCC Explorer on our PC. We covered how to upload data to the TCC Cloud and the proper way to download that data to our collector. Along with that, we synced and edited newly created job files back to the cloud. And lastly, we can use TBC to download and upload data to and from TCC. That concludes our Tech Talk on Trimble Access Sync. We hope you found this beneficial and will join us again next time. Thanks and have a great day.